Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty and today I am working on a 10 by 10 canvas. I seem to be stuck on those lately but I am going to attempt a fire and ice pour. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to do it as ring pours. I'm going to try. I, it's probably too small of a canvas, but it's all about experimentation, right? So, this is my fire side, and this is my ice side. Not sure. Not really sure about these colors, but we'll see. So, today I am using, for my ice side, I am using Creative Inspirations Sky Blue, Soho Manganese Blue Hue. That's kind of hard to say sometimes. Um, Soho Prussian Blue. Yeah. And for the fire side, I am using Creative Inspirations Permanent Red. Creative Inspirations Cat Orange. And Creative Inspirations Cad Yellow Light Hue. I don't know, you think of fire and you think like red, orange, yellow. Um, and then I also added some Liquitex Basics Titanium White. So, I'm going to get started. I think I have about the same amount. But I'm just going to pour, um, I'll do one ring pour on one side and the other on the other. So, let's see if I can see how I do. not really good at layering paints, but let's see. It's a lot of red. So I'm just going in circles here, and I'm making big circles. I'm kind of moving it over here to this side. I'm going to stop here. I don't know. I'm trying to think if I want to stop or not. Yeah, I'm going to go stop. And I'm going to go ahead and pour the blue over this. I don't know how it's going to come out. Okay, 
So now I'm thinking, I'm wondering if I have enough paint. Because I don't really want to stretch it and then not have enough and then stretch it too much. Having a torch while I think. I don't. Okay, I'm going to stretch it. So I kind of want to keep them like on their own sides if I can. I'm not really sure that's going to work. Trying not to lose too many of my, my five side rings. I don't know. I know I had a, I done a, where to do all oh, the bottle bottom pour, and I rewatched the video, and I was, <laughs> there was a certain point to it when I said to myself that I should have just stopped there. And I totally didn't. Um, if I would have, it would have looked like a flower. But, how you learn, right? Right, so I'm not, there's a lot of white on there, on that one side. I'm just, I'm not sure how I feel about this. I don't, no, I, there's, I don't think there's anything else. Um, I'm torch it, see what happens.
can see some. There's some orange popping up through the blue. I'm not really sure how I feel about it, actually. I think there's a lot of light on there. I think I'm going to take it. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I want to take it that way to move some of that white. But then I'll end up stretching. I think I'll end up stretching too much of that. Trying to look at it from another angle. I had to do it. Oh, that's definitely different. Look at that. I mean, it's, it's kind of cool. I'll check the corners real quick. Dandy mirror. Alright, I think, I think, I think I'm going to torch it. Okay, hang it up and I'll bring it out for a close up. I'm not sure if it's very fiery. Fiery? That's the word. Fiery or icy. Alright, let's bring it up there. focus. Come on now. I mean, in that light blue band right there, there are little rings. I don't know if you guys can really see them. I have a short focus. There's my attempt at fire and ice, you guys. So, 
Thank you for watching, and I think I'm going to leave it. Um, if you like my video, hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't. Hit that bell next to it, and you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. Share my videos if you think they're good enough to share or share with your friends. And um, I hope to see you on the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.